are you looking for any business email solution for your organization or even a free uh, G Suite alternate solution then uh, you want to organize your team you want to share documents you want to share emails maybe even chat also otherwise you just want email solution so that you can use those business emails on different services like for email warm up email marketing or uh, external SMTP like a magazine ACS then we have a good uh, solution which is a repeated company for uh, business email there you can create up to thousand business email accounts on your domain or even say multiple domains okay to organize your teams so before dive into it my name is Vishwanath Reddy from Pani here we share uh, software deals reviews uh, tutorials and free tools okay please like our video and subscribe to our youtube channel and we have product channel also so please subscribe and feel free to join our group and visit our website keep sharing the valuable and informative content to your friends who need this thank you so much so let's dive into the today's topic that is and x 365 business this is a service similar to microsoft 365 google workplace workspace doesn't all work solutions and all so here uh, the index is a uh, as you may already know this is a non popular service similar to google like uh, they started with search engine then uh, they have been uh, working on different solutions for businesses like uh, index maps search engine image chart drive messenger email here today we discuss about index mail for business usually you can create uh, business emails on uh, any uh, cpanel server but that is not so reliable or due to the server because that depends upon the server and uh, other solutions like uh, uh, microsoft 365 uh, google joho and other services cost uh, money monthly money and joho also provide uh, five business email accounts for free but they don't support smtp for external use but here and x they support external smtp and imap also like you can you know, receive the incoming messages and you can connect to any client like outlook and uh, mail body etc to manage your emails clients so in you can use in uh, receive an alerts also on uh, telegram so there are different uh, uh, interconnected services and uh, i feel it is reliable and this uh, not uh, a new company so uh, we can uh, bet on that so especially i'm getting started with migrating the business emails uh, which are less important otherwise uh, my own businesses to manage that so let's uh, start it here we will go to this particular url i will share that in the description okay and x 360 there click on get started okay it opens up the another landing page here these are the plans basic plans plans available on index 360 basic optimal advanced uh, as far as you know these are actually uh, very uh, cheap when compared to other services okay uh, so you can check them out if you need uh, Today we are going to speak about the free plan so we will go down so click on try limited version click on that then uh, some pop-up comes like uh, you get you want to start with basic plan otherwise uh, you want to go with the limited version so you click on try limited version again that is free okay so you can see the differences there so as i logged in to my account already uh, i have already created another organization here i can create another organization like create new organization uh, here i am going to set up new organization for my new domain so this is my login click on continue i already log in so here it is asking to set up email so means i need to add the domain first 
so how to add the domain first i have already uh, added my dns on cloudflare like uh, usually i buy uh, domain on dyna dot my favorite uh, domain registrar then uh, i restart the dns migrate the dns to cloudflare uh, which is easy and free to manage uh, you can i will share the dns setup cloudflare dns setup uh, video in the description also you can check them out how to set up that and then next step here we are going to add the domain so my domain is this one okay i want to uh, set up business email for this so for this actually i need to verify my domain on index so for this actually i'm going to add it uh, dns record to verify that so i am going to add this so how can i add this i just click on uh, uh, go to cloudflare okay here click on add a text record okay here i give at usually uh, by default we give that and this and x record this information and dns uh, content okay if you click on save it should uh, save it uh, because this is already added uh, text record click on save okay so this is added here now i go here i added it before and i deleted again to confirmation so uh, this is uh, taking uh, one minute confirmation from the cache actually dns cache so uh, after uh, entering these details here you click on uh, confirmation like uh, check uh, the uh, dns records once you once i under check that if the dns record is verified then you will see like this domain ownership is confirmed it means you you own that particular domain like that so click on that now you want to uh, add several records like uh, when you want to send email you need to add mx records on the domain dns and uh, spf and dkm uh, when you set up all these then your uh, mail is good to go and it is perfect for outgoing and incoming mails okay so mx record is for receiving emails uh, here we can uh, click on delegate that is nothing but uh, you can migrate the dns settings to index here i don't want to do that because i'm using cloudflare cloudflare which is free and uh, very efficient so i want to verify it manually configure manually so here you get mx record okay uh, usually uh, inbox mail server uh, so servers provide up to three mx records uh, like google joho or anything but uh, and x provide only one so here uh, we need to add a mx record like this we copy this click on here add record then this is mx type because mail server then click on name mail server is this you can check this at again so for most of the records it will be at and then this server you can give ttl or you can give it or leave it to auto otherwise some whatever you want to keep and priority will be for first inbox it will be 10 if you are adding another mx card then it will be like 20 50 30 something like that so you can keep on increasing the priority just to uh, for the better deliverability of the email into your inbox okay click on save so mx card is saved here i want to check it again yes they mentioned like if you want you can mention this number of seconds there so mx card is configured correctly it is verified by index then go for configure spf i want to uh, add spf record like spoof record okay and to my dns so here i go and click on txt record here i give add symbol and yes spf record is being added click on save here you can see spf index dot end means whatever you whenever you send email from index server that will be verified that this is original one uh, this is authorized email so your email will land up in most probably in the inbox rather than junk box and if you are managing the external ip addresses for sending emails then you can add this particular record in this format 
okay so here i'm using this because i'm using an index server so i'm using this record and then click on check again so spf record also configured and verified correctly and then configure dkm domain key something like that these also related to uh mail so we are going to add this click on add record this also text record again oh sorry here it will be mail underscore domain key and this value will be this click on this save so it comes like this okay and usually you have to uh, remember if you have any previous mx records pointing to another domain you have to delete them because inbox you can only access at particular server not at multiple places you can forward the emails that is another scenario but you cannot have multiple type of mx records like if you have index and x if you have google workspace google workspace if you have joho joho something like if you have cpanel cpanel that's it so okay here we have added this dkinf record let's go and verify that so it is checking that so uh, now why i love cloud flare even it is free because that is very efficient and fast so it's like we just added the dns record and it is reflected already within seconds if not in minutes so this is how we configure the domain okay this is done fairly done so you can use this particular domain for sending receiving emails and you can organize you can uh, create email inboxes for your employees so click on employees here uh, no need to bother about anything else as of now okay so here we do not have any employee so i want to create one here uh, let me create uh, one inbox on my name so ignore then this okay okay position give founder whatever nothing there is no drop down something and yes this is important because uh, you are creating this particular domain for this user when they log in into that they don't want to land in uh, russian until unless they know russian so you have to come here and change it again so create this click on save the email inbox is created you can even make them an admin uh, like this and you can change the information later if you need like uh, changing the language or something like that okay so this is how you do and you can ask them to log in uh, to their own inbox and they can uh, uh, access other services also like they have this uh, disk disk is nothing but google drive just like google drive then uh, telemos uh, they have a lot of services actually uh, like notes messenger contacts calendar uh, sim very 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 similar to google services google business services so this is how you uh, set up uh, the index business email uh, people come and log in into their inbox at this url i will share this also otherwise you can just google it or search it so it's like this so people come and log in there okay yeah this is how it is done yes we have set the password and we'll share that password to the user to log in and we will share the url once they log in they can uh, check the email you can check the email here also this is like default email when you created that uh, particular email okay uh, i don't want to end up in uh, russian so i just create yeah okay so this is how it is and if it is required click on mail yeah the only issue i find in this services is that most of the links directly go to uh, russian language not english even though you log you prefer your settings in english uh, like that okay so this one drawback i felt there like see here i log to english dashboard and click on mail here it is uh, redirecting to dot ru means russian uh, domain and russian language but i prefer english so that settings are not uh, uniform across this but uh, i say it works it works perfectly and fine and smooth 
and uh, the best part is it is free so enjoy this and if you uh, feel this information youtube tutorial is uh, video tutorial is useful for you or anyone else please share it helps us to motivate to work on this more i do this because i enjoy this i like sharing a small uh, simple small knowledge i don't think i'm an expert or guru here but uh, i'm just i like sharing whatever i use and i like so it uh, it helps us to work more on this okay thank you